Hi there, uh, here's another question on exchange rates as part of our MCQ revision series. This is another calculation question, and in this case, we're asked to calculate a trade weighted exchange rate index. So let's look at the data. We're told that country X trades with just two countries, Nigeria and Malaysia. 80% of countries, country X is traded with Nigeria, whose currency is the Naira, and 20% is with Malaysia, whose currency is the Ringgit. Initially, we're told that the value of the trade weighted index is 100, so it's a kind of base year there. <clears throat> we're then told the value of country's currency X goes up against the Naira by 10%, and it goes up against the Ringgit by 50%. We're then asked to calculate the value of the country X's new trade weighted exchange rate index. What will be the value of the index? It's clearly going to be above 100 because its currency is appreciated against both, both other currencies. What's the value? Press the pause button, have a go at the question, come back to me when you're ready. I'll be here in a few seconds with the right answer. So this is one of these questions where we're being asked to calculate a trade weighted exchange rate index. The crucial point is that the answer is B, 118, uh, that, that the index has gone up by 18%. The crucial point, of course, is that the Naira is the most significant currency. It's 80%, whereas 20% is just the ringgit for Malaysia. So we have to calculate a trade weighted index. To do that, we take each currency, we, we assign a base, or we assign an index number for each currency. So for Nigeria, 10% rise in the currency, so the index has gone up from 100 to 110. We multiply by the weighting of 80. For Malaysia, the index of their currency has gone up from 100 to 150. 50% increase, we apply a weighting of 20 to that. So it's 110 times by 80 plus 150 times by 20. We're going to be dividing by the sum of the weights, which is always 100 in this case. So we end up with 11,800 divided by 100, which gives a figure of 118. It's been an 18% rise overall in the value of the trade weighted exchange rate index. That's one of these calculation questions which you have to do as part of the new A-level course.